All right, everybody, for this video here, I'm going to be answering a, lot of, a question a lot of you may be having when you're buying a Zippo, or you might, uh, if you're new to Zippo, right? And if you're not, and say you've been buying Zippos for a long time and you want to know more about this, that's why I made this video. Uh, people seem to want to know about it and what I think about it, so I'm going to give you what I think about it and how I go about it. So the day-old question is, Brass versus chrome. What do I want? Well, that all depends what you want out of a Zippo. I'm going to show you everything you need to know. So, now, do you want a Zippo that you don't have to take much care of and is always going to look good? And you know what I mean? It, over the years, is just going to still look good and you can just clean it up quick, quick, and it'll still look fairly new? Then you're going to want to go with a chrome Zippo, right? Like, these are two used brass Zippos compared to two brand new brass Zippos. This brass zippo looks brand new. The insert, brand new, right? Never been filled, never been struck. The date on it, it's almost 10 years old, okay? Don't use it, stays like that. This zippo from 2002, brass, nice brass insert. Also never been struck, everything looks good. Tw almost 20 years old, it's 18 years old from 2002. Okay, if you don't use the brass ones, they stay looking good, but you use them, they get like this and they get blacker and blacker. But if you're a metal guy like me, I can polish these up. I can have them looking better than that one. I can polish these up, make them look brand new again, but the insert, you can't. So the insert's always going to look black like that because it's brass. It goes like purple black. And then look at the one on here. See, it's just weared back to steel, right? Because these are only brass coated. You can see some of the original coating left on there. So that's something you're always gonna have to deal with with brass, but I'll tell you, when you got a brand new lighter, nothing looks better than a brand new brass lighter compared to a brand new chrome lighter, right? Like, this is just your brand new chrome lighter, that's what they look like. And they'll, they can stay looking like this for a long time because this steel case polishes right back to new, steel insert polishes back to new, the chrome will polish back to new, you know what I mean? And you wanna know what a chrome uh, polish looks like, when I first got this Zippo, all these lines were filled with black. It was it was terrible looking. It's an old Zippo from the 90s. Okay. And I put this on the buffer, boom, brought it right back to life. You could see you could see me, you could see my shirt in it. Wearing a Venom shirt. And then this is another one. Look at okay, see the initials there? See how you could see the brass? When I, this same thing, and you couldn't see the reflection. Like, see, so you, you can see my Venom shirt again. You couldn't see the reflection in that. And you, these, this word is brass, because this is, the Zippo is, the case is brass, and then the chrome is coating on it. These are all black. And all that scratching in there, and all the scratching. When I buffed it, it went back to brass, the chrome went back to a polish. Everything looks good again. So that's the nice thing about chrome. You bring them back to life very easy. Clean the insert, just give it a quick polish, they go right back to brand new. That's what I love about these chrome ones. Okay, so if you want one that's always gonna look good and you don't wanna take care of it, you wanna use chrome. If you're gonna use a brass one and you always want it to look good, you're gonna have to polish it or buy new ones all the time or whatever you wanna do with it. But if you like brass like me and you like it just looking old, then you're gonna have no issues. Cause like when this, the blacker this gets, the better for me, I, I don't mind. I have ones that I look like to look brand new or whatever if I want one. But whenever I wanna bring out a nice Zippo, I bring out my solid sterling silver Zippo and let me tell you, she shines. So I don't gotta worry about that. But for you guys that are who are new to this, you might wanna know, oh, what's, what's what? Well, let me tell you this. This Zippo's from the 60s, a chrome. Look how good it looks. Still see me in it. High polished chrome. So if you want a long lasting Zippo, go chrome. They tend to last longer, they tend to be better. But, personally I prefer a brass Zippo. I just love the look, I love the feel, I love the way they look when they're brand new and brand new polished and brand new insert. Like doesn't that look so great? So anyways guys, I hope that helps clears up some uh, chrome or brass issues. And the brass, there's brass there's brass cleaner you can put on and polish too to get it all looking good so you don't have to think that oh no it just wears and that's uh you can just get barkeeper's friend and you rub it on with a microfiber rag and it'll bring it right back to nice and clean it won't look like this 
but it'll it'll bring life back to this brass and then if you just use chrome rim cleaner on this on these chrome zippos you just put a little chrome cleaner it puts a protective wax coat on the chrome keeps it shiny keeps it healthy keeps it from getting those micro scratches i have a video on it it's pretty old it's got a few thousand views people like it a lot of people are doing it you just use chrome rim cleaner on it and those are just some uh tips and tricks and things i wanted to help you decide whether you're going to get a brass or a chrome zippo and if you have any questions or anything you want to know, please ask. Go in the comments, and I hope this helps. Everybody take care.